Hello, my name is Anthony Fatchen and we're at corporate headquarters of Hardy International in Denmark. I'd like to talk a little bit about the Alpha product range. The Alpha is one of five uh, self-propelled families that we have in our range and the Alpha is the one that is uh, most suited to European conditions. Um, the Alpha self-propelled um, has a uh, Deutz six-cylinder um, uh, water-cooled engine powering um, a hydraulic, uh, one or two hydraulic pumps and then these pumps are powering uh, four hydraulic motors that give us our propulsion. The whole machine is hydrostatic and it is also four-wheel drive, uh, sorry, uh, four-wheel steer so that um, we're only making one set of tracks in the field. Um, this sprayer is a 5,100 litre sprayer and it's, in this case it's equipped with a um, uh, a 36 meter twin force air assisted boom. When we uh, fill the sprayer it would be done from here um, through, um, sorry, from here uh, and we would uh, choose uh, through this switch box we would choose to be filling uh, the blue uh, indicating the suction side. We would choose to have this up here so it's indicating that we're filling from here and in this case uh, this would be, this icon would be set to here so we're filling the tank. When we uh, finish uh, the filling process and introducing the pesticide, then we would go back and choose uh, the boom, so in this position, and we would choose the main tank uh, here, which is here, and this and this is our normal spraying position. In the filling process, we could also be working with the um, chem filler. And here we have this uh, unit where we would be introducing our material here and then we could wash the containers and um, then at the end of it all then we would uh, operate this and it would wash all the inside and uh, this is done with clean water so this is clean at the end and then when we're finished we go back up there. Um, the Alpha is also running the Hardy diaphragm pump and this is um, through the, uh, the pressure regulation system of the Dynamic Fluid 4 um, supplying uh, pressure to the nozzles. The nozzle range, uh, typically the pressure range is between 1.5 and, and 5 bar and uh, once we've programmed the uh, computer in the, in the uh, self-propelled uh, with the application rate, the application rate is maintained even if we change our speeds. The uh, air assisted uh, twin force boom is powered by two fans and we see those mounted on each side of the boom and here uh, we can um, supply air uh, depending on, on, yeah, we can supply air depending on the uh, on what we're spraying. If, if we're spraying bare ground we would have very little air just enough to push the small drops or the drops down to the ground if we have a, a very high crop, um, then we would be using the, the maximum amount and anything in between. So this is why it's called the twin system, because we can spray with or without air and anything in between. We can also angle um, the boom uh, outlet and the nozzles, depending on um, the, um, the, the direction of the wind in the field that we're spraying in. And uh, typically, um, if, if, we have a head, if we have a wind coming from the front of the machine, we would typically have the angling faced forward uh, so to try and counteract um, um, the wind uh, hitting the, the nozzles when we're driving forward. This uh, particular uh, unit is equipped with a boom management system called Ultra Terrain which is an electronic boom management system to try and maintain the correct height of the boom over the target. Um, the boom is also uh, mechanically set up for what we call negative tilt. So in this case it's a 36 metre boom and if we're spraying um, on, 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 a, on, a, on a hilltop where, where the, it slopes um, down then the boom can actually go under the, um, the, the, the zero degrees and come down to a negative uh, position to try and keep the correct height over the crop or the ground. Um, the auto terrain is also a, a, a feed forward system where we have some uh, technique mounted actually on the center frame and on the chassis of the machine. So 
when the when the when the sprayer changes angle, um, this is detected by it's a roll sensor detected on the center part, and it's already sending oil out to the uh, boom that needs to be lifted up, the boom wing that needs to go up. And then the final adjustment is done by the uh, ultrasonic sensors on the boom wings to uh, fine tune the, the position. Um, the Alpha, as you can see uh, behind this sign, um, we have a, an airbag system. So um, uh, this Alpha is an air ride. Uh, um, model and uh, to have a, a smoother ride so we can spray faster for more capacity. The axles uh, in this uh, uh, machine are also hydraulically adjusted so uh, we can um, uh, on the go change the uh, or the track width we can go from two meters uh, up to three meters and this is done as I said on the go um, no need to mechanically adjust it.